Hello guys, welcome to my channel. This is Tin from TechRudranch.com, and today I'm gonna uh, teach you LaTeX. So if you have a questions and if you want to add your mathematics questions in a web browser, so here uh, this video will help you how you can add your mathematics questions, uh, maybe uh, answers, maybe a uh, questions. So here we will see a lot more thing. So first I want to show you a uh, demo it here. Uh, here are the post you can post anything it here but not videos and audios but you can post any content and uh, also you can post a mathematics questions if you don't know what is the latex don't worry about that i will uh, teach you step by step okay so we will not uh, escape any step it here so you can understand and this code will be available on krishnarato.com so you can download uh, this code over there okay so let's get start uh, to um, uh, show a demo so here uh, is a sample uh, code okay just I'm copying this post it here and pasting it here okay and with that I want to add a mathematics questions so I have a latex code it here so this is my latex code if you don't know what is a latex but don't worry about that you need to learn that uh, but if you have a project in a future and uh, mm, uh, you want to add a mathematics so this uh, code uh, you don't need to remember you just uh, lots of people in the world uh, know what is the latex and uh, lots of universities and uh, uh, teach uh, latex programming it's not a program it's a symbols and uh, it will represent the mathematics questions so I have added the content and the latex uh, it will automatically convert this code like this okay so just post it here and you can see here uh, posted successfully so it will uh, we can see bottom of that so you can see youtube american uh, video sharing websites and i will add uh, this questions it here so it's working so i am uh, posting a plain text it here just copy the plain text and just again paste it without any latex code and it's also posted and you can see bottom of that you uh, can see clearly okay so uh, now uh, the time is uh, to write a code and uh, so you can get a uh, benefit and you can add your uh, latex code your mathematics code okay so first you need to subscribe my channel just click it here this is the take uh channel on youtube and uh, also you can go at uh, krishnaratho.com this is the site which we have a uh, build uh, for uh, making good uh, uh, for making uh, good understanding of programming so you can get a benefit also that <laughs> okay so we have seen um, a demo and uh, also we have a uh, posted it here a lot more thing we have uh, seen but uh, this time uh, but now the time is uh, to write a code uh, of latex okay so open your google and type a uh, math uh, checks uh, matchx this is the library uh, which we uh, use it here just uh, click it matchx this is the jquery plugin uh, uh, it will uh, it's free but you need to uh, donate it's not necessary but uh, the peoples the some peoples are working so hard and they make uh, such a great thing so our responsibility and uh, says uh, we need to uh, donate okay so first you need to uh, donate and but you without donation you can also uh, download this code okay so just bottom of that lots of uh, companies uh, and the universities and uh, 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 have uh, uh, worked with this okay so here are the contact us visit uh, on a github just click it here and it will redirect to a uh, github page just click on magix and you need to download this uh, source code uh, click it here and clone I will already download so I will not uh, download it again so this is my matchx uh, master which I have uh, downloaded from uh, github.com and I've extracted it you just need to just copy whole uh, cop uh, this code you need to just all the uh, files and folders you need to copy and go to your project okay my project is YouTube and inside have a, uh, a matchx a sub project and inside have a vendor folder and you can paste it here and you can simply paste in your project file all the files this, this files is exactly same like these files all the files I've extracted it here okay and uh, just go back and this is my project just uh, drag uh, 
I have created CSS and JS uh, folder it here and CSS have styled CSS file and JS have uh, nothing it has a file of JS okay and just drag and drop it inside in your code editor okay so uh, just uh, uh, just so uh, I go just uh, alter shift uh, and enter and it's a full screen now okay so you can uh, see clearly all the codes which I will show you it here so this is the doc type and this is HTML head sec head section head section should be closed and this is the meta tag all the things are uh, similar to our other pages uh, we have our uh, we have taught you in uh, my previous video tutorials so the, uh, HTML is the same and here we have uh, added our uh, bootstrap CDN files if you don't know what is the bootstrap uh, what is the CDN so don't worry about that uh, you can learn uh, to see my previous videos but you don't know what is the CDN and how we can uh, teach so this video I, it's not for you and this video is for those people who know a uh, little bit about CDN the HTML and CSS okay so I've added a uh, bootstrap CDN files and I have added my own CSS file which is a uh, in my project folder and has a C inside a CSS okay so I have added two files which is a bootstrap CD and bootstrap files and my my own style set I have added inside a head section and after that we have a body tag and body tag here uh, has a closed you can see it here okay and before body tag closing uh, we have uh, added some uh, jquery uh, cdn this is the jquery cdn you can go to uh, jquery cdn and you can copy and paste it here and this is a bootstrap cdn which i have uh, uh, you can also same thing okay and this is the latex um, latex so this file uh, what is the uh, math vendor and vendor has a ma uh, magix.js file okay this code we will see later but this code uh, this line this uh, library is important uh, I will uh, show you where it uh, this is file okay where is uh, in our project mathjax.js so again alter shift and enter and go to our project go to vendor and inside we have a downloaded this package from github and you can find mathjax.js file so this file you also need to add inside our project okay just go back uh, to our uh, netbean and you can see we have uh, added our magix uh, library so all the css and js files we have uh, seen but this uh, this is not we have uh, uh, seen so we will uh, discuss it later but first uh, we uh, need to see some other things uh, it here so this is a container uh, container means uh, some okay this is the div and has a class of uh, uh, bootstrap class which is a container and here are the form okay where we are posting this is a text area and this is the button and text area then have the name which is the latex and uh, latex and uh, have a button uh, which is a uh, value as a post now we uh, so you can understand uh, uh, to see our demo and you can uh, imagine uh, that form uh, this form in our demo okay so this is text area which we have copy and paste our latex code and uh, content and this is submit button okay and uh, that's fine and uh, bottom of that form uh, we have a uh, so all our uh, uh, post which comes from uh, database so this will uh, we also see uh, later but first we insert our post uh, from this form so just uh, copy this name okay uh, copy this name and come it here if is set our latex is set okay means uh, uh, just control shift enter and if uh, this is uh, this is set means it has uh, some value okay and it is not empty means this area is not empty so we are uh, uh, connecting to our database okay so this is the local host root this is the username of our uh, mysql and this is the password so password is a blank so we didn't put any password it here and here are the um, 
database name so you can put your own database uh, it here so this is my database is learn php and you can see click on a latex this is my table and this is the 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 code and this is the content which i have encrypt and decrypt the code in my sql so this thing is very important it here uh, how we can decrypt and encrypt uh, uh, the code every content so i will suggest you whenever you make uh, made uh, any project you need to uh, encrypt and decrypt your da mysql database okay so i have a decrypted so uh, due to that i have a put here a encrypt function this function not exist add i will show you how uh, which function uh, which thing uh, inside it has uh, encrypt function so it will automatically encrypt uh, whatever you type it here uh, here okay it will automatically encrypt and uh, uh, this function check exist is for uh, uh, for uh, prevent the duplicate entries okay so if already question says exist it will say uh, question is already says uh, already exist uh, for that okay so encrypt uh, you can put your uh, dollar underscore post latex this latex is exactly this one and this uh, encrypt function uh, takes two parameter which is our string which we have uh, typed it here um, here and the second thing is your encryption key so this is a uh, very important you can put md5 sha1 everything uh, which you have a uh, good uh, shalt you can put it here okay so i have a put in this case you can put anything it here but this will exactly same uh, to a when you decrypt okay so this uh, uh, this will be also uh, discuss it later but uh, you can put anything it here and it's true if it is not exist uh, any questions uh, which we are posting it here so it will insert uh, our database okay you can see it here i have encrypt this uh, code this code I have encrypted and insert inside a query so when it is successfully it will show uh, like this fun uh, this things posted successfully okay so we have inserted and encrypted our data but we didn't see encrypt function it here so just copy this name and come back it encrypt function it here so encrypt function take a two parameters uh, in uh, string and the key string is r which are typing from here and this uh, key is md5 and sa1 any um, uh, key uh, uh, which will uh, automatically encrypt the data and it will uh, stored like this okay i will show you uh, to zoom uh, in you can see this type of data is secure so i will encrypt this function so this is the key and string just copy uh, just just I will uh, so give you a code to download okay don't worry about that and this is the decrypt function automatically when it shows uh, it here okay this I, I have encrypted it here and uh, I have decrypted when I am showing the data in a web browser okay so decrypt function I will uh, discuss it later when we show our post uh, it here okay so encrypt and decrypt both the functions we have seen and this is this function is for the check exist question if it is exist uh, it will says um, uh, false okay and question it is not exist it it says a uh, uh, true <laughs> okay uh, so this functions uh, i have put it here check exist if it is check, uh, question is not exist we have inserted the data inside a database okay so all the things we have seen but decrypt functions we have not seen it here this function is very important uh, we have encrypted and stored inside a database but we we didn't see uh, we didn't see uh, any uh, decrypt uh, thing so we uh, we have inserted uh, data inside a database and uh, we have a check if question is exist or not but we didn't uh, showing any questions it here okay so for that just uh, come back it here uh, so this function uh, this is the container and i have uh, connected to a mysql uh, i okay and select all the records from latex this table which uh, which is this one latex and uh, okay and page all the data from database using a while loop okay and data and data are showing it here data uh, 
this is the decrypt function automatically your data uh, your encrypted data automatically decrypt uh, using this function which we have a uh, uh, make uh, in uh, above okay so this is decrypt function and it will take a uh, two parameters which is the content this content is same like uh, this name okay this content table uh, field and table is latex and have the field is context and this md5 this key is exactly same uh, when you have a encrypt okay so i have a encrypt sf sfs df434 you can put your country name anything you can put but this will match uh, this thing okay so we have shown uh, all the records uh, all the questions it here but we didn't see latex okay so this code is very important okay so you just need to uh, text uh, x matrix config this i'm zoom in so you can see uh, for better visual uh, uh, for better understanding okay this is type text x matrix config and this is uh, actually this is the folder okay in our uh, vendor this is the config and have lots of js files we don't uh, care about it you just need to uh, uh, like uh, we have a type text uh, CSS text uh, JavaScript like this 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 is also a same X method uh, matrix config Okay, and this is the object uh, object of matrix and have the hub um, uh, um, Property and have inside a config Okay, you need to just copy and paste and this is uh, you need to uh, just uh, same thing You need to type it here and whenever you are uh, in this page in this page okay anywhere if you have a latex code okay just uh, um, it is not important the the latex code is coming from database or if it has a static uh, HTML and a static latex and anything if it has your uh, latex code in this page uh, so it will so automatically convert your latex code to this equation this type of the equation so this is like a query.com and this strategy exactly like that this is the good example query.com and uh, I think they are using the same strategy I don't know which uh, thing they are using but uh, this is the same strategy and uh, the input uh, latex is a uh, uh, HTML and CSS so this is uh, converted HTML when we in, uh, uh, inspect this uh, you can see exactly this is the HTML you can see all the uh, it it's written uh, in a HTML codes latex are uh, returning okay so where we can find uh, this code uh, this is very simple and you can get uh, this code you can type like uh, like me and you uh, can see the result uh, in your uh, web browser okay so it's a uh, done but i want to show you uh, some extra thing it here so which we ha uh, we have uh, downloaded uh, this package from github.com and have the uh, 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 vendor a uh, folder uh, inside we have a paste and here are the tests so lots of examples it here and you can also get the latex code just uh, drag and drop it here and here are the some latex code uh, you can uh, test it just copy this code and you can test uh, this code when you make like this functionality and post it here so it's done it's showing a bottom of that you can see the equations are showing ex exactly okay so this uh, this is the good this code will available on uh, krishna uh, krishna uh, rato.com i think krishna rato.com i don't know krishna rato.com uh, okay uh, this is my own site uh, the code will be available uh, here okay you can get a sign up and you can uh, also contact me on skype gajanan.kgn underscore 3 and start learning and there are the lots of videos and resources to learn programming okay and if you have a project for me you can uh, go to a take uh, rudranshi.com and so this is our website uh, you can uh, get in touch uh, with us okay and get a code if you have a project and uh, also this is our youtube channel so please subscribe my channel and uh, give me a feedback uh, and uh, if you have a problem to understand uh, this tutorial and uh, if you want to get a code okay you can request me I'm always here to help you so thanks for watching and bye take care